Life is full of decisions. And if you make videos, one of these important decisions is what video editing software you will use. And two of those big names are Adobe Premiere and Final Cut Pro 10. For those people that are in the Apple ecosystem, one of the most compelling and straightforward systems to use is Final Cut Pro 10, considering that it is Mac only. Well, I'm here to tell you today that if you have not tried Final Cut Pro 10 and you're on the Mac, you're missing out, okay? You're missing out. Is it the best software? Maybe. That depends on your style and your taste. Is it super efficient? Heck, yes it is. Okay, check, check. It's the best software to use, hands down. I'm totally just kidding because I use Adobe Premiere Pro. The last four videos that I've done, I have been using Final Cut Pro 10. Currently, if you didn't know, Apple is offering a 90 day free trial. You probably know what this video is about. And it is about that Final Cut Pro 10 is coming to the iPad. I've got resources on the inside of Apple. That's actually a joke. I, I, I really don't. I wish I did, but I, I, I follow people on Twitter that have inside sources. So uh, I trust them because they have a great track record. And uh, yeah. Okay, I said earlier that I like Premiere Pro, but I really, really like Final Cut Pro 10 as well. I think it's actually a great skill to be well-versed in both of those platforms. When Final Cut Pro 10 comes to the iPad is not for certain, but, 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 we can probably infer that it will be at the end of this 90-day free trial period or kind of somewhere around there. At least that's my best guess. With that, I say, keep looking out for... What? Keep looking out for Final Cut Pro 10 because it is such a great video editing software and I really enjoy it and it, it it's just, it's unmatched in what Apple has done to optimize that system. The magnetic timeline is a little tricky, but I promise you after editing a couple videos on it, you'll kind of start to gain some rhythm and if you watch some tutorials on how to use it or get some workflows, I promise you you'll be pretty efficient at using that system and you won't even probably want to look back honestly so try it out and let me know what you think of it if you're a video editor um and if you're not hi <laughs> okay i don't know what that was but i, I cry okay i'm gonna leave now okay bye